Hi, everyone, welcome to Ace Movie. In this video, you will see how to add music to Facebook videos without copyright. This video will be divided into two parts. Part 1. How to add music to Facebook video. Part 2. How to find music for Facebook videos without copyright. Next, I'll show you how to do it. Part 1. How to add music to Facebook video. Firstly, you need to import the video and song to the media box. You can click on it to upload. Or directly drag and drop the files into the box. The second step, to add the video to the timeline. You can directly drag and drop the video and song to timeline. If you have multiple video clips to add, you can press Ctrl A to select all the video files and drag them to the timeline. To adjust the order of the clips, Directly drag the one you want to change, and drop it to the place you want. The third step, add music to video. To add music to your video, you can click on the audio button on the left menu, and choose a background song, or sound effect to your video. If you already have a background song, Import it to the media box then add it to the timeline. The background track might be longer than your video. You'll need to drag the edge of the music track on the timeline and adjust its length. The last step is to export your video to Facebook. Part 2. How to find music for Facebook video without copyright. If the music in your video is copyrighted, it'll be muted by Facebook. In this part, I'm going to walk you through how to find the best music for Facebook video without copyright strikes. The first way. Use your own music. If you yourself are a music or sound creator, you can make songs for your videos. This is the best and safest way to put music on your Facebook videos. The second way. Request for a license. If you want to use the music from others, You'll have to contact the owners of the songs and get the license from them. Here are some basic procedures to get the license. First things first, determine if the copyrighted work requires permission. Here, we can see that, it says Creative Commons Attribution License, Reuse Allowed. It means we can use this song. Next, identify the rights needed to use it. Here, it says we can use this song but we must copy the following credit in our video description. If the song you want to use need to be purchased, you must contact the owner and negotiate a payment. Then get the licensing agreement verified in writing. Once you get the license, you can submit it before you upload your video. The third way. Use Facebook Sound Collection. To avoid copyright issues, you can also use the sound collection from Facebook for your videos. Facebook owns a huge collection of music and sound effects, you can feel free to use them on your videos without copyright. The fourth way. Use uncopyrighted music. If you're not that into songs in Facebook's sound collection, you can find uncopyrighted songs from other resources, such as YouTube Audio Library. YouTube Audio Library has many free music and sound effects. If you don't have much demand for music, then YouTube Audio Library can basically meet your needs. Mixkit is a great free stock library. It has millions of music tracks, sound effects, etc. All audio clips are royalty free and can be used with no attribution or sign up required. Here is the Ben sound. It also have royalty free music for free and use it in your video. But you must credit bensound.com when you use the sound. Examples of a proper way to credit bensound, like that. There are four, you cannot, and one, you can, you must know that when use the sound in bensound. You can also use the songs in Ace Movie's built-in audio library. Directly drag the song onto the timeline, you can get the video with music right away. For Facebook, Uncopyrighted music is always preferred to set the mood for your video without infringement issues. 
With Ace Movie, you can also find the music you need in the software and edit it right away. After the editing, you can choose the best ratio aspect for Facebook and export the video. Then upload the video with music on Facebook without copyright issues. That's it for today's video tutorial. If you have any suggestions, let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to like and subscribe for the new videos on the channel. See you next time.